And we turn to Let's Play Fallout 2. Alright. So, I did go back to look at the, uh, the mod, the Maria mod, and apparently, uh, I'm not the only one who has have it, is having problems with it. Um, so I'm, I'm gonna wait a little bit to kind of figure out, or wait, wait for them to figure out, um, the stuff for me here, because I, I don't even know where to begin looking through the mod. So I guess we go down to the Broken Hills next. I have to say, we, we almost made it uneventfully. Oh, where am I, first of all? Is this me? I guess that's me. Okay. Okay, not terrible, then. Maria thing uh, pisses me off just a little bit because actually I, I really need her to be useful. there's anything else here. Not seeing any any herbs or anything like that. Just a pile of rocks. Okay, well, 500 or 400 experience. That's not too bad, I guess. Um, 60 out of 90. Mm -hmm. Alright. Let's do a quick save here now that we've stopped. Broken Hills. Broken Hills, a mining town, mostly uranium ore. Could be a rough place to so watch yourself. What did you just say? Oh, my spot. Oh, what? <laughs> see a smiling man dressed in leather armor. You see a ghoul. He's currently laying underneath the front bumper. He appears to be in considerable pain. Maybe if your driving skills were better, you could have avoided this. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Who's this? Uh, Steve, the greeter. Put your weapons away. We don't... Okay. Oh, God damn it, that's not what I wanted. Put your weapons away. Everybody has to put weapons away. What's okay, your great. Uh, talk Yo, about your gear. Friend. Put your weapon Sounds away. Good. This is, uh, this is actually annoying. Put your weapon away. 
Put your weapon away. What's up? You got my gear? Sure. Okay. I'm Steve. I'm the guy who can tell you where's where and what's what in this fine town. Can I direct you someplace or give you any help today? Uh, tell me about the place. We're a small mining community. We were founded several decades ago by our sheriff Marcus and a man named Jacob. The two of them chose this site because it was near some uranium deposits. Would you like to hear more? Sure. We make our living by refining the ore we dig from the hills and selling it to nearby communities like Vault City, Gecko, and the New California Republic. We use some ourselves for our own power. More. So now we're eking out a living, creating our own version of civilization, and doing our best to avoid giving in to Vault City or NCR. We don't need their style of government. That's all. Okay, I've got more questions. Who's in charge here? Or how about what's new here? Fine. Not much, really. Okay. Who's in charge here? Nominally, nominally, Sheriff Marcus is in charge of the city. He helped found it, and he helps us through our crises. In truth, though, everyone in the city has a voice. Uh... The guy who helped who helped create the city still in charge. I would make him very, very old. He is old, but he's holding up well. See, he's a mutant, and apparently they live longer than most other folks. Uh, really, I would have thought most of them would have died off by now. Mutant sheriff, I bet most folks... I don't know, I mean... I don't know how respectful I have to be with these guys. I mean, I don't, I mean, he just says they live longer than most, but, and I don't, I don't know, like, I guess this is kind of questioning, oh, whatever. A mutant sheriff, huh? I'll bet most folks here are pretty law-abiding then. Must work out well. We find that it works fine for our purposes, plus Marcus is, is eminently fair. We're going to find him. You can usually find Marcus near the bank. That also serves as a tougher jail, or at the jail. Sometimes he's in the tavern or at home. He's usually working. Tell me about the place. Who lives here? We're a collective of humans, mutants, and ghouls. We don't have racial tensions that plague Vault City in our eyes. Everyone's equal. Equal. Everyone's equal. We all come from humans. We all have the same core underneath the exterior. To say that someone's evil just because of their appearance indicates only ignorance. <laughs> Who knows that the, what the virus mutated him into? Uh, I, that's true. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Welcome to Broken Hills. Oh, wait. What services do you have here? We have a mine, a refinery, a tavern, a hotel, which, by the way, has lost its owner, so we just let people stay there for free. Nice. Vic might need a heal. A hospital, a general store, and a chemist. We grow our own food. All right. We have to trade. Nothing. Thank you and goodbye. Hey, buddy. The name's Lumpy. Could you help me out of here for a second? Oh my god, are you okay, Lumpy? No, just peachy. Aside from several compound fractures and a hood ornament lodged several feet up my ass, I'm right as rain. Alright. <laughs> well. <laughs> See you later. Uh, do you need me to help you? Lumpy silently looks you in the eyes. He blinks. He blinks again. I'll take that as a yes. Goddamn right, yes. I can barely move. Now, mind you, I ain't whining. I've had worse scrapes. Wait, why this ain't nothing compared to that mix-up years ago with the cola truck down south a ways. You should... You should have seen it, kid. Caps everywhere. Wow, imagine someone running across that in the desert. They'd be rich. You bet. Ah, I hate to put a damper on this scintillating conversation, but if you could help me out here from under the bumper, I'd appreciate it. You sure? You probably shouldn't move. Ah, don't worry about it. Eventually everything will pop back into place. Okay, get ready. I told them we need traffic signs, I said, but they didn't listen. No, they just don't listen to old Lumpy. Lumpy... Lumpy was the guy from north, wasn't he? He's off wandering again. Because we, we asked why, why the name Lumpy. Yeah, okay. What is going on over here? I guess we can go check out. When's the caravan leave? Oh. Unity patrol. You think after all this time the civilized ways? Okay. Can we just wander in here? How come they get their guns? What do we got around here? Guess we go inside. Hmm. 
Medium sized man. Howdy, Barb. What can I do for you? I need to. Uh, who are you? How about me? I'm Bill. I am, as the man said, the bill you have to pay. Though technically, I suppose sometimes I pay you. I'm the caravan outfitter for this town. I plan the caravan routes and arrange for provisioning. I hire people for jobs, and I'm also in charge of the unity patrols. Jobs, what sort of jobs? You want a job? Well, we got two choices. Shoveling Brahmin dung for a day, for a hundred bucks, or you can escort one of our caravans for two hundred. We got caravans to Gecko, the New California Republic, and Vault City. Uh, changed my mind. I'd like something else. What do you want? I'd like to buy stuff. Yeah, what do you want to buy? Shotgun, rope. What is that? Not anything I can use. That's a 45. I use 44. Okay. Well, uh, actually... You want anything more from me? Yes, I do. So, uh, what we can actually do here is shovel crap. Because there's a perk attached to this. I'll shovel some crap for a while. Alright, get started. You done? Great. Here's your hundred bucks. And if you need anything else, let me know. How much time does this take? Okay. 17, 28. Looking for a job. Shovel some more crap. Oh, it's a whole day. It takes a whole day. All right. We got to do this five times. So we just waste a week here shoveling shit for a pittance, honestly. Compared to what I can get. I'm sure I'm sure the town of Arroyo will be more than more than appreciative that I wasted a week doing this instead of looking for a geck. Become an expert excrement expediter. 500 experience points. And... That. You can sling bow with the best of them. I believe that gave... It did. It gave me a boost to my speech. So, you know. Free monies and all. Why not? Free money, free experience, and uh, extra boost to my speech. Can't go wrong with that. Unless, of course, we need that week that I just wasted. Now that we've got the car, though, I think we'll be fine for time. Wow, you guys don't have anything in here. Noink. Noink. It doesn't count as stealing, so I guess it's just like, oh, hey... Wow. So the guy, the guy they just hired for a week has the nerve to just poke through their desks and steal shit. Hey, who's that? Short, spry gentleman. Very short man, looks friendly and brave. His gaze darts around as if looking for shiny objects. Hey there, friend. Haven't seen any jewels or precious metals on around anywhere, have you? Uh, what's your name? Me? I'm Mickey. Suave and debonair. Treasure hunter of Broken Hills. Treasure hunter. Don't tell me you haven't heard of me. You've never been told of the tales of the fast Mickey? Look, I've been shoveling dung for a week. As soon as I got here, in fact. Of his running gun battles, two-fisted action, and pernicious plunderings? I'm afraid I've never had the pleasure. Well, you're missing out, friend. One of these days, I'll have to fill you in on the gory details. Anything to trade? Nothing good. Well, I'll be waiting with bated breath. So, any riches you need tracked down? I'm the best of the best. And not today, but if I run across any, I'll let you know. Oh, well, I guess I shouldn't be surprised. The market for treasure hunters has really dropped in recent years. The whole death and famine and fight for survival thing really hurts people's sense of adventure. Keep me in mind, though, if anything comes up, you'll be first on my list. All right. Let's head back to the beginning of town here. Take everything in order. A metal door. Is that... It's not locked. Good.
Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Oh, there's a door I gotta open somewhere. There it is. Squat man wearing squalid clothing. What do you want? Uh, who are you? Me? I'm Brian. I work the generator that powers this place. I see, that's very interesting. Must be rewarding work. Well, no, it's not. Not really. I mostly just sit here and make sure none of the dials flip out. I make some minor adjustments. I flip some switches. That's about all. Anyone can do it. Anyone, huh? Now, I have other, other questions. What is this place? This place is the power station for Broken Hills. What I do is essentially a maintenance job on the place. Make sure it keeps running. It's pretty damn functional, though. Powered by uranium slugs. Uranium slugs. Well, with the uranium mine right there, and with atomic power being the power of the future, it seems only right that we keep up with the times. We might be small, but we're progressive. Okay, I've got other questions. Ever heard of a gek? Gek. Never heard of it. I'd imagine no one else here has either. It sounds like an animal or something that is, has nasty claws, though. Well, that's not what I'm looking for. I have more questions. Okay, none. Do you have anything to trade? Any money? You got a gun? Some money. All right. I think, uh, I think I'm all traded out. Let's see here. VDU, a monitor. Monitor. Computer. Is that just a computer? I guess I can't do anything with it. Yeah. Come down here and see if we can't maybe use this. Computer console for the power station. You probably shouldn't touch this equipment without good reason. Okay, fair, <laughs> fair enough. The general store. Here we go. Except that I've, I'm pretty sure I've traded everything. All right? Got my spear. Yeah, like you guys. Well, if I wanted these. Uh, I think this is extra now. I got some jet. Okay, so I do have a few things I could trade. May as well trade them to me now, then, yeah? I don't think I need that. That's just regular leather armor. Uh, I'm still on the fence about getting rid of those rockets. We might come across it later. Okay. Trade them to me. One thing I have noticed... I mean, it's getting worse, it seems, what you be need? is that uh, Cassidy, his pathfinding just absolutely blows. What? Oh, got grenades over in uh, what's-his-face's inventory, too. Right. I think we're good to go there. Yeah, he takes forever. All right, and I need to hit this again, not because I want the quick save, but because I can't see what time it is on the recording software without it. I can't imagine anything is going to be on these tables, because it's a store and therefore everything would be in here. However, I wonder... Let's go sneak over there. Guess she didn't tell me to not. Okay, <laughs> nothing in here. Oh, you guys. We do have a, a new Coca-Cola machine we can play around with, but we don't need to be doing that. Woman wearing a perpetual scowl, Liz, manager of the general store. Hi, I'm Liz. What do you want? What can you tell me about this town? It's a boring little mining town filled with all sorts of undesirables. You want a guided tour? Talk to Steve or someone else. Well, a crabby one. I have more questions. Now what? you have anything special you could set me up with that isn't on the shelves? What are we talking about here? Looks at you and your party. Uh, no, sorry, I don't think I have anything special that you would find useful. What you see out here is what you get. Okay, let's see what you got. You want to buy something? Fine. This is what I got. So I wonder what she has that I'm not qualified for. Hmm. 
Mm. Can't get a hundred bucks out of that. Ah, uh, pretty darn close. I don't think I need a lighter for anything. Who doesn't have metal armor? <clears throat> uh, Vic. Yeah, God, that's too expensive. I mean, I say too expensive. I've, I'm walking around with more money than I can probably spend right now. I think I've got everything I want. Unless someone later in the game starts selling, like, laser rifles and shit. I mean, I, <clears throat> I do have this. It's not nearly enough. Let me let me look real quick. Sulik Sulik is also missing out on something here. So he what you be needing? Okay. Um you Take off it, friend. You Take off the armor. It, friend. I wish it would tell you the stats in dialogue without having to actually open all this crap and see. Alright. Armor class... Where are we? 28. So, like, 3? That's, that's better, though. Why? Oh, because I put it on my... Oh, right. I was like, why do I have that in my inventory? Right, so... I'm not sure that that is better than that. It is better than this, otherwise I wouldn't be wearing this. I'll have to look up the actual stats, because obviously armor class is much worse. But there's other stats like how much defense and, and how much damage mitigation and all that stuff. It does. The game doesn't want to tell me that stuff here. So. What you be needing? Giving you that back. Does that look like metal armor to you? I don't think it is. No, he's got the Mark II armor. Okay, well, I, I still think... I think metal armor would be better than that as well. Eh, you know what, screw it. trade right now. We'll, we'll just trade for the one thing. That. Right. Now wait a minute though, because... No, I just waste so much damn time constantly fiddling around the trading mechanic. What did she just say, though? So there's something I want to buy. Done. One other thing. Okay, okay. I thought, I thought it said the other thing, and we we're going to talk about this again if we're persistent, maybe. I don't know. I think there, there's got to be something else about maybe my karma and reputation? Maybe? Like, maybe that's too good? If I were to lose that, maybe 
She could have some sneakier stuff. This looks like a big and important building. Hmm. This looks like... Well, okay, it looks like a jail. This looks like a, uh... The, 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 the Children of the Atom from the first game. Like one of their buildings. You cannot get there. I'm assuming that is a cell, so I don't really want to try and break my way into that. Can I help you? Uh, I don't know. Just looking around. Yeah, well, look somewhere else. We got criminals here. Okay. Yeah, I don't think uh, I don't think I can steal anything anyway. I can't get into the storeroom. If that even is a storeroom. What the hell is this? Hmm. Oh, whatever. All right. I told you to stop eating that iguana on a stick. Oh? Is that a restaurant? It looks like a restaurant here. I love you, Wugums. What? Is this the inn? Dirty looking mutant. What the hell do you want? Get out of my house, Pinky. Where's my cat's paw? You threw it out again, didn't you? What do you need to feel for when you got me right here? Oh, oh my. Yoink. Never know when I'll need those. You want to see the back side of my hand, woman? I don't want anything associated with your backside. Fun, fun. Anything good on the table? I swear one of these days I'm just going to up and leave. Then what's his lazy hide going to do? Wearing a sweatshirt, sweat-stained button-down dress shirt with a yellow undershirt underneath. He seems to be waiting for something. Hmm. So his house has how many people in it? Because I would consider this to be more of a hotel myself, but female townsperson, where the NCR will try to suck us in. Nah, we don't need that. Oops. Get out of my goddamned way. Oh, fuck. For real? Some of my best friends are mutants and ghouls. Yoink. All you're doing is hanging out in town anyway. You don't need that. You're not an adventurer like me. Early old mutant. With a weary cast to his face, he still looks vigorous and tough. Okay. What do you want, human? Uh, who are you? I'm Marcus. Help build the place. Now I'm sheriff. You helped build this place? That must have been a long time ago. Long story. Want it short, or the whole thing? Oh, let's hear it all. Right. After the master and the vats were destroyed, I wandered a bit. No place to go. One day got attacked by this fool wearing power armor. Okay. That was Jacob, from the Brotherhood of Steel. He'd sworn some oath to destroy muties. Well, we tussled for a while. <laughs> Probably a day or two. After a while, we just started laughing. What was the point? Then what? And we became friends. Headed off together. Then, other people started following us. Guess they figured if they weren't safe with a mutie in a steel night, safe just wasn't going to happen. So you set up here. Why? Uranium mine. I knew there was one around from old maps. Now, anybody's welcome here, long as they act right. Others might not think much of us, but nobody's more free than we are. 
There you go. Wait, you were friends with a guy from the Brotherhood? Damn right. Best friend I ever had. Okay. Hmm, I don't know. Like, this is kind of... Do we want to go down that route? I don't think so. But then it just ends conversation. That's really wanted. weird. What's the story with this place? Long story. Okay, Wanted we gotta do it again. Or the whole thing. Uh, neither. I have more questions. Something else you wanted? Why aren't mute? Why aren't you mutants attacking me? What's the news? What's news? What's news? Well, getting kind of worried about one of our caravan guys, Chad. He might be skimming. You up to checking him out for me? Uh, sure, I'll do it. Great. Let me know when you found something, right? Okay. Something else you wanted? I have something I wanted to tell you. Yeah? What? Nothing, forget it. What? Something else you wanted? Wanna travel with me? Too many people. I've done my traveling with a horde. Okay. I think that's because Maria um, is taking up a slot. Uh, God damn it. Could have sold some more stuff to him. Otherwise, he would have. Probably. If we fulfill his quests and whatnot. Can we actually get into this building? Or is he just effectively blocking the whole damn thing? Nope, we can get in there. Probably not a good idea to be stealing from the sheriff, but you know. I'm the chosen one. Get in there. Pack of cigarettes and a rubber doll. Take both of those. Nothing out in the little cactus garden. I would go in there, but you guys are now in there. Oh, fuck me. Okay, nothing else there. God damn it. Oh my god, you guys. Come on, filter in. Jesus Christ. Alright. Well, that's that half of the town. Um, actually, wait a minute. There's something else in here. If we actually do go talk to someone, I don't know who else we're at with. Um, scruffy looking man. What? Now, who are you? Manson. Rebel against society. What are you rebelling against? Society wants us to believe humans and mutants are meant to live together, but the mutants are out to kill us. At least, that's what Frank says. You really like Frank, huh? Yeah, I think he's one of the wisest people I ever knew. Jacob's smart, but he ain't as straight as a Frank. Okay. <sighs> so, Marcus and this Jacob, right, supposedly came out together at the end of the first game, which was like 80 years ago, right? So that's why we make comment that Marcus should be really old, except that mutants live for a very long time. But Marcus, or Jacob, would be human. And yet he's still apparently here? I haven't met the guy. I have no opinion on him. What else you want? Why are you in jail? I'm here because me and Frank were working against what society wants us to believe. And that is, society wants us to believe it. But mutants are out to kill us. At least that's what Frank says. That's going to be the dumbest thing I ever heard. What would you know, you jerk? Get the hell out of here before you get hurt. Tell me about Broken Hills. Broken Hills? Lived here all my life. That's how I know all the bad stuff that goes on here. That's why I know how evil the mutants are. It's a good thing there are some of us who see the truth. Perhaps you ought to realize that the only blinders you have are the ones you allow other people to put on you, and that preaching the politics of hatred only makes you look more stupid. Ooh. Nothing. What? You like Frank? 
Yeah, I think he's one of the... Wait, what? You preached open-mindedness to Manson. 300 experience. Okay. Da, 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 da. Haven't met him. Uh, why are you called Manson? Back in the olden days, there was a guy who told us all we had to think... We told us all we had to think for ourselves. My mom and dad said he was related to me. He died in prison. But he was really influential to me. People said he was really smart. I think they were right. I mean, look at me. Uh, yeah, look at you. What would you know? <laughs> okay. Anything else we can ask? Why are you so stupid? Nothing, forget it. I think we got what we came for here, which was the free 300 experience. Cannot get there. Rimini. No, don't! Don't open it. Talk to the fucking guy. There. Stupid pixel hunting. What do you want? Who are you? I'm Frank. I'd ask who you are, but I don't care. Oh, a tough guy, eh? Yeah, I'm a tough guy. If I weren't in jail, I'd prove it to you. You think you're tough? Think you can prove it? Loser? Well, I mean, actually, yeah, I probably, probably could take you. The law around here is based on mutant love. Do you hate mutants? No. Muty lover, get out of here. I don't want to breathe the same air as you. Now, I'm curious about this guy, though. Why are you locked in with supplies? You shouldn't be around here. Okay. Anyway, that's all we came here for. It was just that. Anyway, I'll end this one here. I'll see you next time.